A jury has acquitted a former Ohio doctor on murder charges after he was accused of speeding up the deaths of 14 people. Prosecutors say William Hustle gave many patients 10 times the fentanyl that expert witnesses said would be normal in a non-surgical setting. His attorney argued the former doctor was simply trying to minimize their pain and the hospital where he worked did not have set limits on dosing. The jury deliberated for seven days and found him not guilty on all charges. WikiLeaks founder Julian Assange is one step closer to coming to the United States to face spying charges. Today, a British judge formally approved that extradition, but the case now heads to Britain's interior minister for approval, and there are a few more possible appeals. He has been fighting to avoid a trial in the U.S. on charges related to WikiLeaks publication of classified documents. His attorneys now have four weeks to try to make their case to the interior minister. A train accident in Argentina shocked witnesses, and you can see it all on surveillance video. We do want to warn you, though, it is tough to watch, but incredibly, the woman is okay. Look here and look for the woman in white. She's on the right side of your screen. Published reports say that she fainted and then took a tumble right underneath the moving train. This happened in Buenos Aires on Monday. It is hard to watch, and you can see how disturbing it was for the people who were right there who actually watched the accident. She was rescued. They took her to the hospital, but we're told she was not seriously hurt, which is amazing. She told one TV station there in Argentina that she doesn't know how she's alive, and she's trying to make sense of it all.